In this video, we'll find the oxidation numbers for each element here in Cr2SO43. It's a bit involved, but we have these rules here to guide us. The first thing is, this is a neutral compound. There's no plus or minus up here. Neutral compound, everything's going to add up to zero. So all the oxidation numbers will add up to zero. So that's something that's going to guide us in our work here. We don't know what the Cr is, the chromium. That has different oxidation states, so we'll have to figure out what it is by what it's bonded to. So one thing that can help is we know if we have ions that all the oxidation numbers add up to the charge on the ion. In the sulfate ion, that has a two minus charge. So the oxidation numbers here, they're all gonna add up to the charge. So these will all add up to minus two. We have three of them. So the total is gonna be minus six on this side. So we'll have a minus six here for all of this. That means this is gonna to have to be plus six because we said it's gonna all add up to zero. So two times something will give us plus six. Two times plus three, that's plus six. So the oxidation number on each of the CRs here, each of these chromium atoms, that's plus three. We could also figure out the oxidation number on the sulfur here. Let's just do that based on the sulfate ion though. So let's clean this up. So for the sulfate ion, SO4, which we said had a two minus charge, we don't know what the sulfur is. But we do know that oxygen is going to be a minus two oxidation number. Each one of these four oxygens is going to be minus two. So we're just looking here at the SO4, nothing else right now. So we said sulfur, that's going to be X, and we're going to have four oxygen atoms, and each one is minus two, and it's going to add up to the charge on the ion. We said the sulfate ion is minus two. So we have X minus eight equals minus two. We add eight to both sides. X equals a positive six. So the oxidation number on the sulfur here is plus six. So these are the oxidation numbers on each element here in Cr2, SO4, three. It's called chromium three sulfate. A little bit involved. It's very helpful if you memorize things like SO4, the sulfate ion, is minus two that has charge of minus two. Um, from there, you just work your way through. This is Dr. B. Thanks for watching.